Hi guys, welcome to this quick review about the Syncwire PD30 Watts USB C charge Syncwire. It's a really good company. I've already tested a couple of devices from them and they worked all very, very good. And here is one of their latest devices, their PD30 Watt USB C charger. And it's really small. You can see how small this is. Of course, it has just one outlet and it ha doesn't have the, a folding plug. But if you're good with that uh, regarding price and size and power, yeah, it's uh, I think one of the best choices on the market definitely at the moment. And uh, I'm going to show you how powerful this really is. And so it doesn't only support PD but also quick charge of course. And this is a, a quick charge tester. So we are trying to maximize the power output. Let's see how much voltage we can get out here from the quick charge. I'm trying with 20 volts. So let's go back to the voltage. We can see it has been falling back to 12 volts. So as far as I can see, maximum with quick charge is 12 volts. So let's start this test here. So we are on one amp, which means 12 watts. We can increase that a little bit to 20 watts, which is already quite a lot. We can even increase, but you can see it stops at around 25 watts. That seems to be the maximum, so probably the safe maximum is at around 20 watts for quick charge. But we still have a decent voltage, doesn't drop much below 12 volts and we have also the cable it's not directly plugged in so very good value so let's also check with the pd and the first thing of course is to run a protocol test to see the compatibility of this device and you can see we have a lot of greens a lot of compatibility with apple and samsung and uh, u of i standards and as far as i can see the highest value of the quick charge is 20 watts so the 25 watts which we got out was a really good value but you can see the PD goes even up to 33 watts so let's test this too so let's check different voltage we have the 5 volts we have 9 volts we have the 12 volts 15 volts 20 volts so we're going with the 20 volts and we are starting with a load of 1.7 amps so let's try if we can start that and that definitely works and we can see we have 33.8 watts even here. I mean, there's even a loss here through the cable. So it's even more here, probably 35 watts or so. And it got really hot here. It's very hot. I can barely hold it. And here it's still cool. I let it run for a couple of minutes to see how it's performing over time. So you can hear the crazy sound of the fan here. That's a lot of power here which has to be eaten up 33 watts or almost 34 watts and you can see it's still at on 20 volts still on 1.7 amps so very good and let's check the temperature here yeah very low it's barely warm so absolutely crazy how powerful this is so let's stop this here it's so loud so we stop it now still needs to a little bit cool down yeah, it's amazing what this small charge can do, how powerful this is and how good it looks. It has really modern, very modern style, very modern touch, uh, has even this light here. Yeah, it doesn't get any better than that, uh, definitely uh, not at this price point. So I can give you full recommendation on that and I'll put down the link to the Amazon listing down into the description so you can check it out and order it right from there if you like it and I hope I've been able to help you a little bit with this video. If you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below and I'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up, subscribe my channel, thanks for watching, see you next time.